This is Drew with Boomer Music Company, your band and orchestra experts since 1976, and the podcastingstore.com, the one-stop shop for all things podcasting and remote learning. This is your weekend update. Well, greetings and welcome to your weekend update. This is the show where I kind of summarize all the goings on at Boomer Music, uh, the podcasting store in Drums West, and let you know what we've been up to and uh, bring that back to your attention. Well, this week has been like a week-long traffic jam. Uh, I know any of you other parents out there will understand it's soccer season, so we've got that going on. If you've got older kids, it's marching band season. Uh, we had a tryout night on Wednesday and then all the usual goings on at the store, so thank you all for crowding the store we really do appreciate that uh, and if you don't have your stuff yet there's still some time for that so come on in and we'll take care of you well on that note Step Up Day is coming up. Yes, already. It's going to be November 19th, which is the Saturday before Thanksgiving. We're going to have a great selection of Step Up instruments, uh, representatives for manufacturers there, rental credit incentives, you name it. And if you've been renting from us for a couple of years, it's time to at least explore your options. If you've got something in mind, uh, let us know. We'll try to get it in. And if you don't have something in mind, come on by and try stuff out. Uh, we're going to, it's always a good time. We really enjoy doing it, uh, getting to show you all what is out there within your chosen instrument uh, so you know just check it out it, it's always a fun event there'll be more information coming so uh, if you're current renter from us you'll be getting a postcard in the mail and then of course if you're on the emailing list uh, you'll be getting information that way as well so stay tuned more information to come and then this week on the view from the road it was all the usual stuff out in the schools and uh, again it's the busy time of year what with uh, marching season especially but I got to witness something really cool at one of the schools that I went to and uh, rather than me recap it uh, here's a clip from that video kind of explaining that that really awesome thing that I got to see I was talking with the teacher and she was telling me that these kids are just from different worlds basically you've got the ones that are you know more into the nerd culture and the ones that are you know just too cool for school and all that but they all came together to make music and they all have that shared love of that and so that really to me speaks to how universal music is and how it's a unifying activity for a lifetime and something that is worthwhile to get into early and to continue with and it really just bridges those gaps across those uh, perceived divides and kind of knocks down those walls and barriers. Further proof, music is the universal language. Anyone can speak it, anyone can do it. I can't stress that enough. So that was a really, really awesome thing to get to see. Then over on the Podcasting Store uh, YouTube channel, last week I had done an unboxing video uh, of some podcasting gear. And I'm actually using that microphone right now. And as an aside, uh, any manufacturers out there, if your product is right for the podcasting store, send it on over. I'll use it because why not? I love gear. And... Um, what I wanted to do was to show how easy it is to create a video like that. And so uh, I used some of the standard gear that pretty much I always carry with me in my bag uh, to record the video and then edit it down uh, using DaVinci Resolve, a free piece of software. So check out the clip from that video as I kind of just give the brief overview of just the simple stuff that I used to create what I thought was a pretty effective video. Check that out. So the gear that I used was really super simple, actually. It was the Hercules DG207B uh, phone holder, and I used three of those because I used three iPhones, as well as the Rode Wireless Go 2 wireless system uh, for sound, and then the Asden EX507XR um, lavalier mic. And uh, then in terms of software, uh, I used... Um, DaVinci Resolve to edit the video and put that all together and then OBS which is the program I'm using right now just a little bit to do some screen capture so I'll talk about each uh, piece of gear individually. So super simple to use a little bit of a learning curve with the software but it's totally worth it but this is very accessible and very approachable so if you're intimidated by it you know, reach out to me I'm more than happy to help you uh, kind of get up to speed in this stuff but it's some really easy to use gear and I think the results speak for themselves so if you haven't seen the full video check that out and if you haven't seen that uh, kind of recap video check that one out too and then over on the podcasting store medium page uh, this week the essay I titled almost finding elder in Ohio. And what this was referring to was uh, a week that I had spent in Ohio and I was a fast food junkie. Well, kind of still am. And I was really getting tired of eating only Wendy's because that's the only game in town in Ohio. At least it was at the time. And I saw that 
beacon of McDonald's and it kind of brought me back to what was home at the time in New Jersey and I just kind of I was outside my comfort zone I just wanted to revisit the familiar and it didn't turn out quite as planned but the lesson from that was that you know sometimes we kind of retreat back into the familiar and uh, recharge our batteries and then we're good to go to uh, try something new and forge on ahead on a path that has you know, led me to here but check out that essay and you'll see what I'm talking about and it was a little bit humorous what happened with uh, my attempt to go to McDonald's. So that is your weekend update. Thank you so much for watching as always. Comment below, let me know what you want to see. Like, share, subscribe, and check out the other videos in the channel. There's a lot of really good stuff out there, and we'll catch up with you next time. If you enjoyed the weekend update, do me a favor and follow us on social media, subscribe to our YouTube channels, or visit our websites. This is Drew with Boomer Music Company and thepodcastingstore.com. Thanks for listening.